Education Time. So we are going to do SOS NSO 2018 question for better understanding of these videos. So I would recommend to watch our previous two videos on the chapter of animal. The links of those videos are in the description. Refer to the given relationship uh, based on the body covering and select the correct option which satisfies the same relationship. So if you see first one is a parky and then next one armadillo and the th next one is a person. So here if you see a parky uh, they are asking on body covering. So parky is a bird which will have feathers as their body covering. Pachetrich and uh, aigret are, uh, are the birds which which have feathers as their body cover making a a and b can be the right answer next one is armadillo so armadillo has the shell help uh, uh, keeping it safe so if you see here uh, um, the uh, it's given flamingo flamingo's body covering is of uh, is full of feathers making a the right answer okay. and an uh, opossum rabbit it makes a uh, uh, they, are, uh, they look quite similar and their body covering has fur. Now let's read the given paragraph. X and Y are animals that possess backbone and slippers. They both have slippers and breathe through lungs. There must be some mammals, reptiles or amphibians or so. Uh, X less as whereas Y gives birth to young ones. So here if you see, um, turtle, turtle is an animal, turtle is an animal and so, turtle and platypus are the animals which possesses backbone and, uh, and, uh, and slippers and breathes through lungs. F lays F, turtle lays F, while Y gives birth to young ones. But here Y is a platypus. You know that platypus and the spiny anteater are the only mammals which lay X. So Y is the animal which gives birth to young ones. Making A the wrong answer. Next option is B, which is frog, fr uh, frog and porcupine. X and Y, frog and porcupine are the animal which possesses backbone, and but a frog does not possess a flipper, and so does a porcupine also does not possess flipper. Making B also the not the right answer. C is a penguin and uh, X is a penguin and Y is a dolphin. Here if you see, uh, they are asking X and Y are animals which possess backbone. These both animals possess backbone, flippers and they both breathe through lungs. X plays X, penguin plays X, uh, whereas y, uh, y, a dolphin, gives birth to young ones. So, C must be the right answer. And D is a seal, D, uh, uh, X, is a, in D, X is a seal. So, X lays F while a seal gives birth to young ones. Refer the given one diagram. Animals that breathe through skin, P can, and animals that breathe through lungs, animals that breathe through spiracles. So here if you see, P must be an earthworm or so because it breathes through its skin. And Q, and Q should be a, a, kind, a, a kind of, um, uh, um, must be a frog because it breathes through both. And S must be some kind of higher, spe uh, higher species like reptiles, uh, reptiles and mammals and uh, birds, etc. And R must be some kind of insect because it breathes through its spiracles. And here if you see, uh, the, the option which currently identifies these are P, a beetle. So here if you see P breathes through skin. A uh, beetle does not breathe through skin. So now let's uh, take out B, beetle and frog. So here we have earthworm and amoeba. Now if you see, Q is a, uh, must be a frog as I told because it breathes through moist skin and lungs. But here is given crocodile. Crocodile is a reptile, you know. So reptiles breathe through, uh, breathe through lungs and lungs only, making C the right answer. Now, fourth one, refer to the given table and select the option that correctly uh, correctly identifies P, Q and R. So, P can swim, yes, it lays F and possesses blubber. So, refer, uh, so P can swim, it can lay F and it possesses blubber. So, it must be P is an animal that lives in cold areas 
and Q it can swim and Q doesn't lay eggs and it possesses blubber. Q must be an animal which lives in cold areas but it must be a ma and mammoth. So now if you see R, uh, it can swim, uh, it can lay eggs, it does not possess its blubber. So and it can swim, it can lay eggs. It must be kind of an animal or uh, like which uh, a water bird or a fish. So uh, an animals like this. But uh, yeah, uh, but it can't be the animals which live in cold because it does not possess a blubber. Blubber is a, a, a layer of fat under the skin which helps uh, the animals living in cold regions uh, to heat uh, to produce heat. Now if you see. P can be a, a dolphin. No, dolphin does not live in cold areas uh, and it does not lay eggs. And next one, it can be a polar bear. It, it, can, it can't be a polar bear because it can't lay eggs. It can swim but it can't lay eggs. Next one is C, penguin. So, pe uh, 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 penguin uh, can swim, it lays eggs and it possesses blubber. So C can be and a D is a duck so it does not purpose as blubber and if you see uh, so C must be the right answer but if you still see Q, Q so that makes a, it can swim, polar bear can swim and it possesses a blubber and does not lay eggs. Yes and R, uh, a duck built platypus can, can swim, yes it can lay eggs, yes and it possesses a blubber, no a duck built platypus is a mammal which uh, as I said before, duck-billed platypus is the, and the spiny anteater is the only mammal which lays uh, as a which lays egg as a mammal, okay? making C the perfect answer. Yeah. Swati made four groups, each covering with two organisms with similar kind of body covering, but she made mistake while pairing organisms in one of the group. Select the incorrect group. So they have made in care in kind of body covering. Crocodile snakes scales, panky emu feathers, turtle crab uh, the shell, pigeon bat. Pigeon bat is the wrong one because pigeon possesses feathers whereas bat has skin. This one is uh, read the given features of an animal X. Four legs are adapted to flying, body covered with feathers, right, light and hollow bones, a streamlined body. So a, it it must be the animal. It must be a, a type of animal that flies. So it is given a penguin. A penguin does not fly because a, bec, uh, and you see by the adaptations, it ha, it does not it does not need light and hollow bones, and it its forelimbs are not adapted for flying, but rather are adapted for swimming. And B is a bat. Uh, yes, they, uh, most of them are right, but if you see the second one, if the condition is given, the body is covered with feathers, while a uh, bat is covered with bare skin. A crate, a crate is a snake, forelimb is not adapted for flying, body is not covered with feathers, does not have light and hollow bones, and does not have a streamlined body, making the uh, Indian crate or the common crate, uh, which is a snake, not the right answer. C cannot be the right answer. D is pigeon, making it the right answer because fallen adapted for flying, body covered with feathers, light and hollow bones, streamlined body. Now they have given a flow chart and we have to we have to uh, answer the uh, uh, select the option which currently identifies C, Q, and R. Now when you see this flow chart, it, uh, it's given that a uh, B is warm blooded and no other no other uh, information and a Q have possesses hair and is not warm blooded and R is possesses hair and is warm blooded uh, sorry Q the, uh, is warm blooded but does not possess ha hair R is a warm blooded it possesses hair so it, it must be a kind of mammal A which given which says P is a par parakeet parakeet is a bird it, it, it is a type of a uh, a parrot, it is a type of a parrot. So this type of bird is warm blooded. So which makes A not the right answer. Now if you see B, B is B says B is polar bear. A polar bear is warm blooded.
uh, and C is a frog. Uh, uh, a frog is not warm blooded, but D is a rabbit. A rabbit is warm blooded. Uh, making C the right answer, but if you see by Q, uh, it is warm blooded and uh, possesses hair. No, because a swallow is a bird which uh, which is warm blooded and does not possess hair, but possesses a uh, feather. And R is an animal like hedgehog. So an animal uh, like hedgehog does possess spines, but spines are uh, spines are also uh, formed in between of hair. So and it is also warm blooded, making C the correct answer. Eight one, select the odd one out on basis of body coverings. So if you see here, A is a, a, a cassowary and P B is a chameleon and C is a python and D is none of this. So if you see here, a cassowary is a bird. And uh, a fun fact about cassowary, it is the most dangerous bird because it is kind of like a dinosaur. Uh, it is a huge bird like emu, uh, like uh, like the ostrich, but it is way more stronger than any other bird. It is also the dangerous bird. But if you see, it it has this hair. It has this hair. It it has these feathers which look like hair. A chameleon and python have scales, and B is none of these. So B and C is not the is the one which is same. And cassowary is the right answer. Refer to the given flow chart and select the option which correctly identifies P to T. And one, yes, it possesses backbone. Yes, it is cold blooded. Yes. So F must be an N, uh, must be like um an uh, animal which is like uh, you know lizard or so. And animal, yes, it possesses backbone. No, have six legs. No, uh, uh, have six legs. Yes, has wings. No. So R must be a type of insect because it has six legs. Animal, yes, it possesses backbone. Uh, no, it has six legs. No. Mm. So it must be a type of invertebrate. P must be a type of invertebrate. So here, if you see, uh, and if there is a Q, so Q must be an animal. Uh, Q must be also be an insect. So here, if you see, R can be an animals which uh, we and um, can be animals which like uh, like uh, you can say ant or ant or so. R could be an animals which can walk like ant. Uh, while P could be an earthworm with uh, no, no backbone and does not have six legs. While while a Q a Q could be animals which can fly. So here, if you see. Uh, a P is mosquito. If you see here, P where is P? P a mosquito. Uh, uh, and if you see, a mosquito flies where it see it's saying that it uh, does not have wings. And uh, so A can't be the right answer. Next, P they're saying is a guppy fish. A guppy fish possesses a backbone, but here the P is given. It does not possess any backbone. Next, C is silverfish. A silverfish is it, it does not have six legs. So P, C also can't be the right. A, B, and C can't be the right answer. The next one is D, earthworm. So here we know that P can so leaves one out, which is which is the earthworm. By seeing the P only, we find out that the D is the right answer as a, a D. A D says that P is an earthworm. So here, if you see, it's an animal. Yes, it does not possess a backbone. Does not have six legs, making it the right answer. Tenth one given below, there are some adaptations shown by animals: large size ears, thick fur on body, thick layer of fat on the skin, aestivation and hibernation. Which of these adaptations can be found in animals living in uh, uh, polar regions? We know that polar region animals do not need large size ears. They need a thick fur on their body, so two will be there. Thick layer of fat under the skin, three will be there, and they will have to do hibernation. But some animals like po the polar bear does activation. Activation is summer sleep, is long summer summer sleep, whereas hibernation is long winter sleep. So uh, uh, two, three, and five are the test. So two, three, and five. Here let us know, Rana. So A is two, three, and five. A A right answer I give. 
which of the following matches are correct blow holes uh, so blow holes scoliodon so they are saying blow holes have scoliodon scoliodon are a type of shark and not mammal so that means they do not have blow holes so one is incorrect so um, next one moist skin earthworm which is correct so let's see let's take out any uh, option which has two a has two b has two and um, a and b have two now if you see third one is spherical honey uh, honey bee does has a spherical so making uh, the third one also wrong so here if you see c has third one making d the right one this is a body covering mohit made for a uh, four group of the e of three organisms each in attempt of doing so he classified organisms incorrectly in one of the group identify uh, this group and select the correct option total snail oyster which is the correct because they all have shell fish this make lizard which is correct because they have scales penguin ostrich bat this is the wrong one because penguin ostrich and bat uh, uh, penguin and ostrich do have uh, feathers but a bat has bat skin and hippopotamus hippopotamus whale and cow are uh, uh, are also the same because they all have skin coming through um let so c is the right answer refer the call for given feature x y z select the correct option x is a duck y is a turtle and z is a a uh, uh, penguin so they are saying they all possess similar body covering no only uh, y and z possess similar body covering they all possesses flippers to swim no only y possesses flippers to swim they all possesses hollow bones to make the body light no uh, the uh, uh, penguin does not need hollow bone therefore does not have hollow bone and even y does not have hollow bones so making it also the wrong answer and a they all possess a uh, uh, similar respiratory organ mm, so a is the right answer in 14th one which is which is categorized animals on basis of their body covering she made three groups and by mistake placed the wrong, one wrong num one wrong member in each group identify the wrong member in each group and select the correct option snake lizard crab so snake and lizard are uh, uh, have scales and the crab does not have a scale sloth platypus salmon sloth and platypus has these hair group 3 penguin and pigeon uh, so mm, you know penguin and pigeon have uh, uh, feathers while a gra- uh, a grasshopper does not have feathers let's highlight uh, uh, the odd one out so which, which we can, it can be easier crab is the odd one out here and salmon is the odd one out here and grasshopper is the odd one out here makes uh, these are the odd one out crab of group 1 should be entertained of uh, uh grasshopper of group 3 they have picked the right uh, the, they have picked the uh, option which is wrong but they are saying to replace it with grasshopper but when you replace grasshopper it won't have any changes because it will it still does not have scales and b is salmon of group 2 should be replaced with a toad toad does not have hair so making b the wrong one and c platypus of group Uh, two should be entertained uh, interchanged with pigeon of group 3 so platypus should not be changed because the problem is here is salmon grasshopper of group 3 should be replaced with a parakeet which is right here because penguin and pigeon are birds which have feathers as their body covering so parakeet also has a uh, feather as their body covering making d the right answer now that there here our uh, NSO uh, uh, SOF NSO 2018 question uh, pa- question paper and here hey. thanks for watching please keep watching uh, our videos for NSO I am I am I am I am so